Hello guys and welcome to Arrows Tutorials. These are the screenshots that were taken from my phone. Have you ever experienced something like this before? If you did, and if you want to browse the web on your Android device with no restrictions, today I'm gonna show you how to do that. First of all, go to your browser, go to google.com and search for Droid VPN. Click on the first link, droidvpn.com and go to the sign up section of this website. Here enter email, enter these letters, accept terms of service and click on the sign up now button. Then you get an email with your password. You'll need it in later steps. Then go to the download section. Here are the two ways of getting the Droid VPN app, but I'll use the second with the direct download link. So click on this URL and after these downloads finishes open it in your downloads folder then copy it now take your android phone or tablet and connect it to the pc with the usb cable after you do that go to computer and find it then choose wherever you want to store this app i'll store mine in the sd card so i'll paste it down here now grab your phone and I'll see you in seconds. Welcome back. Well, first of all, you'll need a kind of file manager. I'll recommend you to go to Play Store and download ES File Explorer File Manager. After you download it, go to your menu. Then find the manager and open it. Now click on this SD card button. Now go wherever you store the Droid VPN app. Mine is stored on external SD, so I'll click here. Find the app and click on it. You'll get a note. Read it and click on settings. Here in the settings, check the unknown sources. You'll get a security note, but click on the OK button. Later, if you want, you can uncheck this option. Then click the back button. Once again, click on droidvpn.apk. Click install. When installation completes, click open. First of all, make sure that you're connected to the internet. Then enter your email. Then the password that was sent to your mail. And then click save my login details. Here, check I trust this application and then click OK. Open servers list. Choose one of the servers. I'll choose free server 4. Click on this big power button. It now says you're connected, but I'll pull down the notification bar to be 100% sure. These two notifications shows your connection security. By clicking the first one, you can disconnect at any time. Let's try opening the Play Store. You should get notes like this one. Click Accept. Welcome to US Google Play. Search for Spotify or Netflix for example. You see the install button? Congratulations, you successfully changed your IP address. From now on, you shouldn't see no more blocked items or websites. Let me know if it works for you. If you have any questions, ask them in the comments below. Please like, share and subscribe. See ya!